What's up guys? Today we will be reviewing the Battle of Hoth, the 20th anniversary May the 4th promotion set. You had to spend $75 to receive it. I have a haul video up on my channel right now. This is coming up probably before the Imperial Landing Craft. We're gonna open this, see what's uh, what you get and everything. I mean, we already know what you get. Looks like we need some scissors. Scissors? Aha. Not scissors, but a pen. I just poked a hole in the box. Crap. Upside down opening, but I don't care. finished the build and yeah it's pretty cool my only issues with it is that um snow speeders are super huge compared to um the shield generator they could have made the shield generator a bit bigger that would have been nice to see i would have liked it the probe droid better if they used one of the white hooks so it looked like it was floating um that would have looked a lot better in my opinion than how it looks right now. The AT-80, the front, the head looks disgusting. Like, it actually looks so bad. Um, I'm just gonna take off 
these gray things and hopefully it'll look better. Yeah, now it actually looks like an ATAT -AT a bit better. So just like take off those uh, gray little bits. I added this extra plate I had on the top. What they should have done is took a 1x2 plate and ran it along here. Um, the bottom guns look terrible. What they should have done, again, was just put it like that. Yeah, it's not perfectly, like, you know, straight, but it looks so much better. It looks actually like an AT-AT -AT now. And I like how they give you some options with where you can put the feet. As opposed to just having it in one position. I like that a lot. The Snowspeeder build themselves is pretty good. It's really good actually. And the 20, 20th anniversary plate is of course printed so it looks very nice thank you for watching this video subscribe like share comment all of that good stuff i'll see you guys next time